Well, vaccine and testing mandates for more than 80 million workers at large companies nationwide that were set to be enforced in the next few days have now been blocked by the Supreme Court. Jen Sullivan has the latest tonight. The Supreme Court delivering a damaging blow to President Biden's efforts to mandate COVID-19 vaccines nationwide, blocking the administration's emergency rule requiring private companies with 100 or more employees to have their workforces fully vaccinated or tested weekly. Private employers can choose to have a vaccine mandate. They can choose to have a vaccine or test mandate. But what the Supreme Court said today is the federal government cannot force them to do that. The Supreme Court did hand a win to the Biden administration, allowing a nation wide vaccine mandate for certain health care workers to go into effect. Uh, CMS's requirement for health care workers to be vaccinated will save the lives of patients as well as the lives of doctors, nurses and others uh, who work in health care settings. It will cover 17 million health care workers at 76,000 medical facilities. The Supreme Court upheld it and we will uh, enforce that. President Biden said in a statement that he's disappointed in the ruling blocking the vaccination requirements for big employers, but the White House says it still plans to encourage private businesses to voluntarily impose vaccine mandates. President Biden will be calling on and will continue to call on businesses to immediately join those who have already stepped up. I'm Jen Sullivan reporting.